So, new season just about to start. Are you going to be fit? <laughs> no. But how long do you think until you'll be ready to play? Um, I mean, I'm four months now. Um, we all know it's a slow injury. Um, it takes time, just about to be patient. But yeah, I'll get there. Yeah, I mean, it must have been a, you know, a huge blow for you, the timing of it as well when it came in May. Yeah, um, I mean, obviously it's not an injury you want to have in football, but we all know it's part of the game. And yeah, just trying to make the best out of it. And it seemed to be, you know, Arsenal seemed to be struck by a curse, didn't they, with Leah, Beth, Vivian as well, going and missing the World Cup as, as well. It must be every player's worst nightmare, isn't it? Yeah, I mean, of course, it's probably the worst injury you can have in football, but I think there are also a few positives you can take out of it. I mean, yeah, of course, you're not really able to move properly for a few months, but it's still an injury or a process where, yeah, you can rely on family, friends, and I think that's also nice to see. And yet, yeah, I still feel really appreciated in, in many ways. And yeah, so that's, I would say, the positive thing out of an injury. And Arsenal this season, the ambition to be back on, get back on top, get above Chelsea perhaps, just to, to get back to that position of superiority from not so long ago? Yeah, definitely. I think we still have three trophies to play for and we want to compete in every single competition and that's definitely our goal for the season, yeah. What's the feeling around the club? Is there, is there confidence? Yeah, definitely, I think. And we do have a really good um, squad now. We do have a good group of people off the pitch as well and... Um, yeah, I think we all know what we're able to, to do and how we are able to perform, and that's what we're going to show this season as well. And, of course, the women's game is just getting higher and higher profile. It went up a notch after the Euros when England won last year, and the World Cup this year has taken it up another level, isn't it? Yeah. Do you feel that? Do you see it around the fans and the, the kids coming to games, getting yeah, involved? Yeah, definitely. I think, yeah, you've seen last season we sold out the Emirates with only Arsenal fans and... And we have a lot of had a lot of games where yeah it was almost sold out and I think yeah it's just special to know to be part of this process as well and for us to know how how incredible our fans are and to yeah step out at the Emirates um, to hear them cheering you on I think that's probably everything you dream of as a football player. Fantastic! Thanks you so much. Thank you so much.